brain should go away now. Thank you very much. Uh, <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to Minecraft on the Beach Block server. Um, yeah, so I got a house full of chests. Um, <laughs> we've been donated some taters and some stone. And there was a little chest there with some stone in it from Kurt. These are from Amelius. Um, and yeah. Both of those were from Amelia's. I've been doing some work here. Um, the pond is gone. The little bridge is gone. There's a new road. It's made out of stone brick instead of gravel. Um, it runs all the way out here to the entrance. I finished it all the way around the tower. The little part that goes over there is not done yet. This little strip here is done. Um, it comes up on the hill to the bridge here. does not continue from this side of the bridge out that way um, yet. I have not gotten to that point. Um, I did this here. These little pieces of gravel are going to get replaced with that uh, that there stuff. I always forget what it's called. I think it's andesite. Yes, andesite. They're going to get replaced with that um, eventually. So um, now you can see I'm down to two levels. I have not died. Um, Here's why I'm down to two levels. I am a tank again. <laughs> I feel much better having all of my stuff re replaced. I just spent like two hours in the nether, or the nether, in the end, at the ender ender, getting um, levels to uh, enchant books with which I repaired my stuff. Um, and it makes me very happy. Um, and then I came back and crafted these beds so that I can replace these. Um, and then I will feel better about this. Now, um, I'm going to leave these signs up, but hey, what happened there? I'm missing a plank, or a half slab, and I don't know why. Um, wrong thing, not a chest, I want a crafting table. I'm not sure why that's missing but okay um anywho uh, that is the right wood right yeah let's get down here I gotta put one more bed right here and you know what I happen to think of I'm, my axe is overpowered I'm not entirely sure somebody was stealing the beds I may have taken those or told somebody to take them for the upstairs in thing over at the minecart gallery game. I have a habit of forgetting when I tell people stuff like that. I, I don't know. It's, it's a possibility. I don't know for sure. Somebody still might have stole them. I don't know. Anyway. Um, so yeah. This road stops. The brick stops here and it's gravel all the way out around to the villager thing. Um, and then I continued it on down to here. Uh, did all this. Has anybody actually been... No. Didn't think so. Uh, did the little part down the hill. Went out past here. And... I still have not stocked this or that with stuff. I stopped here. Um, I replaced the steps there and there. But I still got a little bit of gravel to do there. Um, so, anywho, now... As you can see, I put the road over here to the keep, um, and I tore the bottom of the chicken thing off because that's going to get moved. I'm just not sure where to at this point. Um, also, I um, leveled this out, <laughs> and I moved my reed farm over here, made it a little bigger, um, and I did a little terraforming here. We now have a natural spring right on top of this hill. And it makes a little puddle. And then the little puddle... Hold on a second. Um, we're going to put this here. Like so. Yeah, that looks good. Um, the little puddle streams down here. And funnels into the... Uh, into here. Into the moat. Um, and then it has this little other branch that streams down here, and I can't run because I need to eat again. 
and becomes a little waterfall into this little puddle which streams over into this pond um, which still has to have some terraforming done of its own. I'm going to replace the whole bottom with uh, sand most likely. I do think I'm going to I'm going to actually test this out here in a minute and see how I like it. I may replace the bottom of this. Um, it's going to all get replaced with one thing. I'm just not sure what yet. I think we may do it. I've been doing some work in here too, which I'll get to in a second. Um, let me try this. I want to see what it looks like. I need my shovel. What do you think of that? Actually, I think I like that a lot. Hmm. We're going to think about that. I'm going to leave that there for now. I'm not going to tear all that back up. <laughs> um, so let me throw this in here. Well, put that there and that there and um, those in there. And uh, we're going to throw this and this in here for now. Um, I have something to do with these beds. Now, let's go over this. I have a sheep thing over here. One sheep in each pen. There's 16 pens, eight on the bottom, eight on the top. We just walk up here to get to these eight. Um, I'm going to make all the different colors of dye and make one sheep each color. This is going to be my little wool farm. I'm only going to do one sheep of each. Um, this is just kind of... Uh, I'm, okay, basically everything I have out there, the stuff in the barn, like the farm and everything, I'm going to have farms in here. This is going to be like my, okay, the keep is like your fallback shelter. If, like, your castle gets invaded, you fall back to the keep. And I want to have everything in here to where if we had to fall back, now this is all, like, role play stuff, but if we had to fall back to the keep because the castle's under attack, we could come in here and survive. We would have food and wool we could do stuff with, and all kinds of stuff, but we're 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 gonna be self-sufficient inside of this keep. Um, so yeah, that's that's what that's about. Anyway, um, we're gonna put a sign on here. Um, we're gonna call this "Ye Old Cookhouse." <laughs> that's what we're gonna call it. <laughs> Um, so if you come in here, um, we have us a nice little countertop, butcher area, cutting boards, tools hanging around. Um, this is actually our um, lead out of the uh, barn. Um, I brought those two cows over. Oh, I forgot to replace my piece of leather on this item frame right here. Um, but yeah, we just have two cows out here, and eventually we'll have a wheat farm over here. We can uh, breed them whenever we want to get another cow, and then we'll just kill one. Um, to Then the one that we bred will grow up and replace him. But anyway, um, so then we have our freezer, um, <laughs> and we have some chick. This is just for decoration. There is no functional purpose to this room whatsoever, um, but we got some chickens, some pork, some rabbit, and some steak, and then we have, this just kind of goes up to a little storage room, and then this comes out here to this top of this, um, for no real reason right now at all, um, not sure that that won't change for, you know, that we'll find a purpose for that, but that is the kitchen, um, I need to decorate that up a little bit, I'm aware of that, I'm not sure how I'm going to do it yet. But that's the basics of it. Um, but yeah, I tore down the white walls because I didn't like it at all. I put the stone brick up with the little half slabs on top. I um, uh, still used the andesite for the floor level here. And except for right here where I have this landing. I, I just left the wood there like that. Um, but then, yeah, there's that. So then, uh, I don't remember... Actually, if I had that beacon on last episode or not, now that I think about it, I don't think I did. Uh, but yeah, 
I got a beacon. <laughs> Actually, I'm pretty sure I did not. So I will go ahead and show you that. That is down here. Um, I still need enough iron blocks to finish the bottom layer, but I got three layers done here. Other than I did not replace that center one underneath there with a diamond block, but I don't know that I will. Um, it's just for looks anyway. Um, but yeah, so there's that. This room's going to get decorated up because this will be accessible, uh, at least to me, through this passage here. Um, this right here uh, will be hidden doors. Um, probably have to block this in, which I put those steps up under there, but those weren't probably necessary because that's going to get covered up. Um, where's he at? I think he's outside. Okay, so then... Uh, yeah, this area over here is going to be the other farms and stuff like that, I think. Um, what going to do with that other bed? And then up here we have... Uh, I put the rest of these units in up here on the outsides. Um, they all have beds and crafting tables and torches, just like uh, the, uh, the inn up there on the hill. But we have 16 units. Um, eight on each half of the castle. Well, there's six... 2, 2, and 6. Um, so, yeah, there's that. Also, uh, I think those balconies were there. I added this balcony here um, so that I can, if I'm up here, I can just come out here and run an ender pearl over to the house, um, which will speed up the moving process later on down the road. Um, <laughs> so, then we come in here and go up and this uh, I think I told you before uh, one end of this will be um, the enchanting room and one end will be the brewing I'm not sure which is which yet uh, for whatever reason I have a feeling enchanting is going to be here brewing is going to be there I may switch it around I don't know um, I think I did that like that last episode Maybe not. I don't remember. But there's that. Um, we have a balcony up on the next level. Uh, yeah, I did a lot between the last episode and this one, actually. Um, but yeah. And that brings us to this. Um, I'm not sure how I feel about this yet. But so far, this is my bedroom. Um, I've got my double doors. And... I'm going to put these out here away from the wall because I'm... Why is the... I don't know who torched this up, but there ain't nothing spawning in here, that's for sure. <laughs> I really don't know who torched this up like this. Um, and, but yeah. I'm going to put a big, uh, like, headboard type thing up here. Probably quartz. I don't know. Uh, for whatever reason, I just kind of assume that's what it's going to be, because that's how I am. <laughs> uh, let's see, I'm going to put that up there. What's that? Four in from the end. One, two, three, yeah, four. So, one, two, three, four. Okay. Um, I'm still, I'm not really sure who torched this up like this. Uh, I forget who all was up here looking at this with me. I think E1 and, or no, maybe it was, uh, Emilius and Delusion. And I'm sorry if I'm saying the wrong people. I'm, I, I've told them I'm terrible with names. I can't help it. I don't know what to do about it. That's just how I am. <laughs> I feel bad about it. But I, I don't know what to do about it. I try really hard. I really do. But I'm terrible with names. Um, so, yeah, there's that. Uh, and then somewhere inside of here, uh, there will be... Either a ladder or a hidden staircase or something uh, that's going to go up to the roof. Um, probably just a ladder, actually. Um, but, yeah. So right now we don't have a way up there. But, um, let's see if I can hit that wall. Oh, yeah. Yeah, here's a better look at our little fountain. Then we'll decorate that with flowers and lily pads and stuff like that. But, wow, that water looks really dark for some reason, and I really like it. Huh. I'm not sure why it looks that dark. But yeah, I terraformed that bank. Um, this may come out a little bit here. Uh, as well as over here. I'm not sure. Actually, I may just cut that corner off somewhat. And this may come out some. 
I don't know. Still got a lot of terraforming to do. Haven't done anything else on these towers. Um, really. Well, at all, actually. Um, not just really. Haven't done anything at all. So, um, that brings us to that. And I've got two creepers over there that I don't appreciate at all. One hit and two hits. And they're both dead. Let's go get the gunpowder. Thank you. And a level. Well, par almost a level. Um, so, yeah. That's what I've been up to. Um, I'm going to land in my chicken coop. Ooh, I landed on it. You guys need to lay eggs faster. Hey, a fence went in there. That's interesting. Um, but yeah, that's... uh. Oh, crap. Well, I'm down here now, you know. Uh, oh, there we go. I'm stuck. Okay. So, yeah. I've been up to a lot. <laughs> um, still have a long way to go. And that, I thought... That, by the way, Optifine is not on here right now because I updated to the 1.8.7. I was hoping that would get rid of that glitch. It did not. Um... So, I don't know. Actually, I'm going to go over here and take this torch down off of this outside wall. Because that is not going to stay like that. Um, so. Okay, in other news. Um, if you watch my other series, Feed the Beast Infinity is done. I just finished recording the final episode of that series. Um, the reason being is uh, Eternal has uh, wants to do a different mod pack uh, and finish with uh, Infinity, and that was his server and I was playing on, so um, it's all good. Um, I have decided that I am going to take what I learned in that series, and I'm going to restart my own custom mod pack. Um, it'll just be a single player world, um, but I'm going to do... Like, I'm going to build a base, uh, It's and I talked about all this in, in my Feed the Beast Infinity episode that I just recorded, but I'm going to go ahead and tell you here um, that I don't even know why I came in here, actually. Where are all my villagers? They're all hanging out down here. Um, yeah, I have a bunch of villagers. Still no farmer. I don't know what's up with that. I need to actually bring some bread over here and feed these guys and see if I can't get them to breed some more. Um, oh, I made this uh, villager conversion chamber for zombie villagers. I did that. Um, let's see. There's some other stuff going on with some of the guys on the server. I want to get with them and have them show you their stuff in my videos. So, um, I'm going to try to do that as soon as I can. I'm actually just going to make a whole stack of bread. Um, but anyway, back to Feed the Beast Infinity that I was talking about. Um, that, uh, or my custom mod pack series actually is what I was going to talk about. I'm going to add some of the mods that I just learned uh, about when I was playing Infinity. Um, and um, I'm going to. Th the goal of that series is going to be to build a base and get over there. Get the bread. And. Um, Yeah, so, <clears throat> oh, here we go, maybe, 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 come on, come on, give me a little farmer, you need bread, come on, take, take bread, take bread, make a farmer, come on, whoa, he's like throwing bread at him. Oh, now that one's got hearts. The other one had hearts. 
All right, we'll leave him alone. I'll have to check on it later, see if I got a farmer. I don't know. I'm going to put this bread in this chest. Um, oh, there's leather. Okay, I know what I'm going to do with that. And the rest could stay there. But, yeah. Um, going to, you know, build a base. I'm going to do a lot more tutorial-style videos in that series. And this is not where I needed to go. I need to go over to the keep. Um... And they will be indicated in the title of the video. Uh, it's not going to be a tutorial series per se, but there will be more tutorial type episodes in it. Um, so I'm, I'm hoping you guys will enjoy that. Um, uh, it's, it's something I've been thinking about for a while as far as how to do tutorials. I want to do them you know, very comprehensive style uh, where everything is laid out and easy to comprehend and wrap your head around and all that stuff because I know how it can be to watch a tutorial video and they run right through stuff like you know it already as well as they do and you can't keep up and you got to watch it a bunch of times and that's just I mean yeah great it's great for their their view count if you have to rewatch it but it's kind of irritating to me so I want to try to make um, a comprehensive tutorial uh, style video for um, Probably a, a lot, not a lot, but half maybe. I don't know about half. But several of the episodes in the new modded series. I don't know what I'm going to call it yet either. Um, it's not going to be JT's Mod 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 World. Um, again, that I, I decided I didn't even care for after I did it the first time. And I just kind of went with it for the rest of that series since... Uh, um, uh, that's what I started with, but anyway, so, uh, that's going to be it for this episode, guys, it's a little bit short, but I just kind of wanted to catch you up on what I've been doing, um, spent a lot of time on here in the last week or so, um, building and, uh, just did the, uh, ender ender thing today and got my levels, got my armor back, which I'm very happy about. Need to repair the helmet. Unfortunately, I cannot actually repair this one. It says too expensive. So I'm going to have to make another one, which all I have to do for that is get protection four for this guy. We've got respiration three, we've got aqua affinity and unbreaking. So that's all we need there. My boots do have protection four, feather falling four, depth strider, and unbreaking. The pants and the chest plate are just protection four and unbreaking three. Um, so, yeah, but I'll be good to go. Also, I learned how to not do that again and fail at a wither fight. Uh, uh, as a matter of fact, oh no, I don't have any skeleton heads. Um, that'll be another day. Um, we're, we're actually got a, a thing going in the nether. Um, well, I'm not even going to go in there right now. Uh, but there's a, a fortress in the nether where... Um, there goes my phone, I'm sorry. Where we uh, are... I think we're planning on building a wither skelly farm so that we can get those easier because I still need uh, 21 wither skeleton heads <laughs> because I want seven more beacons. Um, <laughs> so, um, all right, guys, I'm going to call it an episode here. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you're looking forward to the new series, uh, my new modded series, and, um, we'll see you next time. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Bye. Oh, one more thing. 89 subscribers is where we're at. We're trying to get to 100 by the end of the month, and we got about three weeks left. So, actually, we have, it's the 9th today, so we do have three weeks till the 30th. So, we need to get 11 more subs in three weeks, and then I'm going to give away a game. Actually, I mean, I'm, I'm going to give away the game at 100 subs after we've maintained that level for one week, regardless of when it happens. Um, I would just like to see it happen by the end of this month. That's my goal. So, if you guys could help me with that, I would really appreciate it. And... Thanks again, guys. Okay, this time I mean it. Bye.